Uh, and I appreciate you coming up to, as we recognize uh, General Lindbergh for his contribution to our partnership. And uh, as you heard in the words of the citation, during the time that he has been uh, the Chief of Defense of Finland, we have deepened uh, our interoperability with Finnish Armed Forces. Uh, Finnish Armed Forces are making a contribution in Afghanistan. Uh, they've been fighting alongside NATO uh, in Afghanistan for many years. They're contributing uh, in Iraq as well. And, uh, and we've actually had a record number of exercises with Finland uh, under, under General Lindbergh's leadership. And so both uh, as a result of his deepening of the bilateral relationship with the United States and also uh, his deepening the relationship between Finland and NATO as a whole, uh, we wanted to recognize his contribution. He retires on the 1st of August. Uh, today's visit was coincident with his visit to the United Nations. Right. He'll go up there with other chiefs of defense at the UN later this week. So this turned out to be just a great target of opportunity to uh, to recognize his contributions. So again, thanks very much for being here. All right, sir. Uh, yeah, Mika Hentuna from Finnish Broadcasting. Uh, it, how do you see that the U.S. and Finnish uh, defense relations develop? How do you expect them to develop? In which areas and how? Yeah, sure. I, I think, uh, and I'll, I'll let uh, General Lindbergh answer this as well. I think we've had a lot of conversations about the employment of aviation, our command and control systems, uh, integration of combined arms, cyber capabilities. These are all areas where uh, we've had a very vibrant dialogue between Finland and the United States. And to be honest with you, I think given the high level uh, of capability and effectiveness in the Finnish Armed Forces, I think it's fair to say we've learned from each other uh, in, in the dialogue that we've had open.